which case the environmental usage that automatically goes out the window because you're going to be cleaning up and wasting a lot of, a lot of stuff. Generations of high speed presses, they have extremely high speed uh, automated cleaning systems. How do the, the new, these new chemistries work? Will they work in, in the. A lot of hope. Um, okay, a lot of hope. Uh, I work here at the school and I get to read a lot of senior projects, and one of the topics that comes up obviously repeatedly in, in articles that you've read is that print is dying, that the internet's going to replace everything. Um, seeing the efforts that we're making towards sustainability, really lead me to believe that there's a lot of hope for our industry. For me, it's, it's really figuring out, you know, what is the real issue, what's real, what is, you know, fad or, um, you know, perspective or, and just figuring out what can actually be done that really is actually, you know, conserving, what is actually going to, to save money, save time, <coughs> save resources, um, you know, what, what really is green and, how is it, what is its actual impact? Okay, um, what I'm thinking I'm curious about is, are you learning, have you learned, are you learning the things you believe you'll need to know as you're in your current programs to contend with the kinds of issues that were raised today? I mean, do you feel that you're prepared, perhaps not with the knowledge, but certainly with the skills to learn what you have to learn? to deal with the challenges of sustainability, the climate change, um, the culture change that was discussed. It wasn't just technology, right? What's your takeaway? Do you, do, you, do you feel as though we've got to do a lot of work as an industry also in you know, education and you know, course materials and so on and so forth? I definitely think so. Um, traditionally, like education has been out of a textbook. You know, you go to a high school student and you know, say, hey, can I see your calculus book? It's this thick. And the portion of what actually gets used in the classroom could be about maybe that much. So if you want to think about it, we need to think about how we market those products in education as well to see what we can do to educate.